Hi, Mr. Tonza. Hi, how are you? you? You're doing great. Are we audible to you? Can you hear me? Yes. Can you hear us, Mr. Yes. Tonza? I can, I can hear you guys. guys. So how? Okay. So how are you doing today? I'm fine. And you? you? We are great. Doing great. It's it's uh, half hour, half an hour past ten. So we are a little sleepy. It's Indian time. We have to sleep around eleven or twelve. So but but we are really excited for this call. Yeah. So it's, it's actually normally in India it's 10:30, so around 11 we we sleep. Okay. So, so thank you. Yeah. So, so no issues, but we are very. Yeah, well, it's our pleasure. Thank you so much for it's being our opportunity. Great. So, so what I want, I want to, to, to do, do first, first is, is to introduce, introduce myself. myself. So. Okay. I'm a Indian investor and a startup venture. I've been working, working in for Deloitte for 11 years and uh, the last seven that I stayed there, I worked for consulting. So I'm not sure if okay. you know Deloitte, but it's one of the most important consulting firms of the world and considered one of the best in strategy. Which, which was, was the area, area I, I was, was working, working for. for. So, so I stayed there okay. for seven, seven years, years in consulting. I got, got to a position of executive, executive a senior executive, executive there. there. And, and then, then I left to work, work with, with startups. startups. And now I'm, I'm focusing on startups, startups investing, and then also mainstream. So okay. I okay. stayed on Silicon Valley. In the US. 
need, need to, to talk, talk closer, closer to, to the, the microphone. microphone. Okay. Now can you see our screen? Not, Not yet, yet, but, but I, think, I think yes. yes. Now, now I can, I can see, see your screen. screen. Okay. Okay. So let's go about this. organization or the fitness staff interview with the college you are calling it the locker room again, I, I can't, can't hear you, you. The, the sound, sound is, is very is very, very low try, try to, to talk, talk closer to, to the mic can you hear us now mm. just a second just a second Try again. Uh, is it okay now? Yeah, now it's better. better. Okay, now it's better. All right. Great. Okay, so Mr. Tonza, this is what we are trying to get into the sports, fitness, and wellness industry. This is our startup. We are we are calling it the locker room, and we are trying to redefine how sports are looked at in the Indian markets. and how people go about fitness about their daily fitness which includes their holistic fitness mind and body the vision with this startup is to completely transform how indian people look at the fitness how they use fitness how they use it as a service and how we can fit this fitness into their routines so that we get them to good health levels we can give them complete well health health good health we can give them complete wellness and we do try to do this with multiple of things that we take care of under our brand so we identified some key problems which we think exists currently in the industry that is the the in so can you hear me now okay so so with our vision our vision is to completely and and transform less happiness of indian youth and indians overall whoever the people that we are trying to target is the youngsters to make them aware first and then spread the vibe of becoming healthy in a fun and interesting way we also want to bring in the systems that are not currently commercially available to all the and that they should have people do not have recovery systems easily accessible they cannot easily access the recovery systems they are specially meant for the athletes that are into professional or semi professional sports also we are trying to capitalize on the trend of growth of football in india and all the trends that are running in this market related to consumers own health so these are the problems mr stonza that we have identified with our own research we identified that there are lack of weight free training and wellness centers by weight free training i mean the conventional gyms have all the weights the equipments the heavy equipments and they provide training and fitness in a fixed structure they do not let go of the conventional machines so here we are trying to get into the weight free training modules we want to introduce to people the weight free training modules that are available in the west we have also figured out that there are the indian community is not as educated as it should be and the trend is slowly slowly growing that they are also becoming very conscious about their mental wellness they have been into physical wellness but mental wellness they are they are leaving it behind also there are 
the athletes who train regularly or train five times a day they need their body to recover fast so there are no commercially available facilities that help a consumer to recover to to recover their muscles to recover their energy levels or simply a recovery system they don't they don't know about how to train but they do not know how to recover also there is there are some uh, playing specific problems like whenever or someone is playing or training they feel excessive heat in india so the environment here is very hot and they feel excessive heat also the football trend is growing in india so people here in the semi professional world we have been players ourselves we have been playing for 12 years i have played football for 12 years he has played football for 12 years so we you we have started we have seen this trend growing in india where people big players they have laid down pitches artificial pitches that replicate the quality which is installed inside a stadium in a full size stadium so they create small pitches which is which are called the artificial playing surfaces and then they allow players like us the amateur players the small teams they can play 5v5 or 6v6 in small quantity they can utilize that pitch and they can play and have that feel that they would have while playing on a professional football turf those facilities also the current trend here is increase the online food delivery market here is in in india is booming right now but there is no such big player or i would say a, a marginally average player who only just focuses on the fitness foods which is going to be according to me a very 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 big market in the future because here people in india they are becoming diet conscious they are becoming health conscious they have deliveries for food but those foods are fast foods whenever we open swiggy or zomato these are the local companies that deliver food they have plenty of listings about the restaurants but they do not have a section which only caters to the people who are diet conscious and they want to have plenty of options in their diets they only want to see the restaurants that provide them with good high quality healthy organic foods that help their muscle help their health their physical and mental health also the ease of access is something that we have identified as the problem this is the solution that we try to propose into the market <clears throat> we are trying to create a themed fitness arena with professional locker room visuals as it is written we are trying to emulate the feel inside a professional locker room and we are trying to create that ambience to have the psychological edge with the customers so this is what these, these are the services that we have mentioned that we are trying to get into this idea play under the play we have our our network which ha, will provide us with fifa approved artificial playing turf we have also innovated our in field cooling system that we can introduce we can install onto the artificial turf and while the players play it sprinkles water or it makes the environment cool to make it more comfortable for them also these are the recovery systems i'm talking about the ice bath and muscle recovery solutions these solutions are not available to the consumers commercially they do not have these facilities in a in a gym or in a training center they have facilities like these in in a sports facility especially like the athletes or maybe a football club have their it has their private recovery solutions but these are not accessible by the normal users normal consumers like us also in the train section we try to introduce all the amazing workouts that we see on the internet or we know about personally the weight free routine we want to take people off from the conventional equipments to their own weight and to the modules only so that they, it becomes easy for them to work out they can come to the training center they can train there even if they are on the move we provide them with the weight free training routines they work from their phone they are on the move they can see the uh training pattern they can work weight free with there is a very very this is a big problem that we do not have skilled trainers so the conventional trainers that we have they just tell you every they, they tell everybody to do the same thing and then they ask you for personal training to get extra money and they train people to get them extra to get rid of the system and we want to get the skilled trainers to train an efficient class tens maybe 25 not many people but they should be skilled trainers giving them proper techniques and proper expert advice if we can project our brand as a 
export solution for their fitness and health that is the area that we have identified that people want trust they want certified export trainers so that they the goal of getting fit is executed is completed under rtl or brand or maybe some other gym they will step onto the gym they won't become a regular customer they won't become their their lifelong partners until unless they give them the results with export trainers so they do not feel the need to move out step out to look out for some other place to get the new trainers if we give them efficient and skilled training they will be they will turn into our repeated customers here comes the holistic healthcare the body can be taken care of it can be conventional gym or this weight training or anything but mind here in people india in india they are they are worried about what the other person will think if we go to the psychologist all these taboos still are existent in this industry but slowly our young generation understanding from the west who have got this from us only the yoga and me- meditation science we want to reintroduce we want to rebrand meditation as a tool to attain success and happiness people are looking for success people are looking for happiness the uh, meditation the the art of meditation it scientifically proves that the effects it has on the brain it slows down the brain it gets it into the theta wave and then a person is more efficient more productive more creative so these values actually lead to a better style of living and enhanced life where people are happy and they are also attaining success because they are clearly focused here the agenda is to get this into their routine so that they purchase from us daily to get the mind in their routine the services that we provide we want to provide them in a way that they do not move anywhere else they know these are the experts they are taking care of my training they are taking care of my eating they are taking care of my mind they are taking care of my body also the rejuvenation therapies and meditation therapies the specifically the rejuvenation therapies they are offered by i would say tantric people like we tell spiritual people they tell you to go off for 15 days on a on a ashram and then do the rejuvenation therapy here we want to bring that therapy into this busy life into our centers where people can come for 15 days enjoy that therapy and they feel relaxed also under the mind i have not added here but i want to add stress management also how we want to tell people that we will train them to deal with stress also this is a big concern in india people do not know how to deal with stress and they are under under lot of anxiety anxiety creates many troubles they do not even realize they have anxiety so we want to get them to train their mind and body also football is also growing in in exponent it's it's going with phenomenal rate here in india the popularity watch we with watch our purpose is to screen high interest football matches that generate a lot of interest in india specifically there are supporters like mad supporters we want to create that atmosphere with the music and ambience where people feel that we have come here to support the club they have that environment of similar like minded people and they enjoy the match this is the events just the events not a uh, from like primary source of income but this is a this is a key area that can be targeted and that can be brought into our startup with eat our purpose is to complete the solution of wellness with eat we all open a small in house cafe the uh, the uh, absolute solution in the fitness arena we also build a small in house cafe to meet their post training demands people who train after they train they need their post workouts they carry their stuffs in their bags and then they move or they after just finishing after the workout they rush to their their places so that they can have the nutrition timing bang on and they can eat whatever they want to eat we want to get that stuff right after the training where they can sit they can chill with their friends it becomes a popular hangout spot and they also have their demands met also <clears throat> the other idea was to an app create an app <clears throat> which promotes and delivers just the healthy food we want to create a market place for healthy food where people list healthy food the deliveries for the healthy food there are multiple choices to choose from they can choose from they can enjoy the food and this is how we want to hit the peak <clears throat> this is how we want to infuse the technology first by using it for recovery for for better 
health of an athlete or a person who trains. We want to introduce technology to enhance their recovery. Then we want to use technology to allow people to book their spots, like I've mentioned. This is our vision with in the starting phase, and then it expands. Then we want to create a online delivery for health food market. There's one more thing that we want to create is that people here in India, there are a lot of small gyms that are not recognized, that are only hyper local. They might be offering on our data, not everyone, but they, they offer weight free training programs like they have two classes in a day, two hour classes where they also give the same service, but they are not a big brand. They are just localized. If we create a marketplace and app where we can get these small players to list their workouts only and we sell the workouts, the sessions we sell that if you want to do this session, you can go to this place. If you want to do this session, this is nearby. You can go to this place. This is how this gets into the the locker room, the marketplace that's on the app. And also the personalized online training and nutrition is becoming a big space in India. So online personalized training and nutrition is becoming a big space in India. We want to get into that industry as well. We want to provide them with personalized, they put in their information, we give them their personalized training pattern, we give them their personalized nutrition pattern. And that's how we use technology. These are the stats that we have got from our research. This is the size of the industry. 7 million users with professional annual membership in India. This is the market that we are targeting. If we get small percentage of this market, we will consider ourselves to be very successful. That's just a number in our head. But this is the people, they want the service, but they do not have the service. So we are trying to create the service that they want. Also, these are some more stats. What people do to become healthy, they take gym subscriptions, they start exercising at home, we cover all these, they start eating healthy, we cover this, they go for a group fitness class or they play a sport. Also, we have targeted, we have, we have understood, we have segmented, why do people come to, they, why do they think of fitness? 42% do it for losing weight and then their muscle, they are sleeping better and functional strength is a good, improving energy levels, reducing health risk. This is the market that we want to target. These are the people who are really conscious about their health and they want to make sure that they're healthy physically as well as mentally. So this is the first market that we want to hit because these people are already aware and they're looking for a service that fits into their routine, that they, they find a brand that caters to all their wellness and fitness needs. They do not need to go here or there to find what they are looking for. This is our business model. When we rent out the artificial turf, we charge them per hour. When we give them a training plan, we charge subscription. When we give them the watching events, they pay per entry. When we cater to the eating part, we take we charge markup pricing in our in house cafes and then commissions. When we set up our delivery channel and a chain of apps chain of uh, restaurants that, that we put on our apps, we will get commissions when we will give them the footfall from our end. This is our projection for so we can reach in five years if everything goes to our plan. And the market that can we can Hello. Hello. Yeah, Mr. Tonza, you were saying something. Oh, 
Okay. So sh should I restart the revenue part? Okay. So this is with the play. We expect our first unit, the demand as per the demand and all the projections we have done. It's going to run for single unit will run from seven to eight hours daily. And that's eight hours slot booking into the amount that we charge. That's just 2500 or 2200 we are yet to fix on that. If we multiply the revenue with 20 units, this is the amount of money and the footfall in the entire year we are going to get. Under the train part, under the train part, we are trying to get members. We, we are not trying to uh, think in terms of how many packages we can sell. We want to increase our user base. So initially, we are trying to get as many people on the user base. And we are launching Mafedi, one, three, seven, we launch here. And then we get the series funding. Then we will cover the hyper local market. There are 7 million searches every month on Google about hyper local gems. So we want to cover the popular spots so that we can cover the area and people can be targeted easily. And we want to increase the total overall user base for 100 units to 40,000. That's 4,000. 400 for a unit. 400 is just the six hours the training center is running for six hours, three hours in the morning and three hours in the evening, or maybe two hours in the morning and four hours in the evening. And this comes out to be revenue. This watch includes our events of screening events. Also, the events that we conduct with FIFA console gaming, we want to enter small, small parts under the watch function. People are really interested in playing FIFA here, the youngsters, the football community. They enter a tournament, they pay, pay the entry fee, they enter the tournament, they play the tournament, they win, they get the prize money and the rest amount we, we get to keep it. So we will <coughs> conduct tournaments for the play and for watch for gaming consoles and then this is the each revenue, the in-house and offline, the online and offline both that can be reached. The 50,000 users can be done in five years, in the span of five years, 50,000 users can be achieved. And this is how we can proceed. If we just charge minimum amount for delivery or convenience fees, just say rupees 10 or 20, the amount comes to be this, divided into two sections, offline and online. This is the competition that we have here. This is the on the left extreme, the base plaza. This is the competition that we have in the play sector. The, this place was created by base plaza, Adidas. Adidas. This is named base plaza and created by Adidas. They have three pitches, artificial pitches, and they just have the pitches. They rent it out and people go there because it's a brand, it's Adidas. They have small little features to give them the edge. So the main competitor in this category will be our Base Adidas Base Plaza. Then in the fitness and training category, which is the train, we have Pure Fit. This is a new startup. This was started around uh, 2015. 2015. This was started in 2015. In two years, they have got their user base to one lakh. This is the. I'm just trying to project how much users are there. They are willing to use the services provide if provided in the right manner. They have 1 lakh users in the uh, training uh, zone and they also are getting into multiple industries at the same time in the wellness and fitness industry since people now trust their brand and they are loving their services because it's never seen before and they get to do something else and they are getting fit and also their branding and marketing is top notch. Then here is the locker room. We, would, we are cutting down this becomes more convenient because we think the the values that we are giving, we are not going to charge them super phenomenal money, but we are going to keep it in the mid range, not too high, not too low, but initially in mid range to attract the customers. In the first month, it's going to be low to have a massive attraction, 
but slowly slowly we keep it in the mid range to cater to all the people because our vision is to get the youth fit so this is our page which is the competitive edge i think we have the competitive edge because of our branding strategy that is meditation as a happiness and success and health tool also because of our new routines that are not here people are not even aware of it also we get the cooling technology inside our playing turf we get the recovery facility ice bath facility to deliver we are trying to keep the price in that is beneficial for both us and the consumers also we are installing the latest generation of artificial grass which is also going to be a huge attraction point we also play also in now cafe to meet their this is our go to marketing strategy we are going to pull people this is to raise their awareness and spark interest this one or com competition of comp competition this one okay comp okay okay so i'll i'll repeat again what why we believe this is our competitive advantages we are introducing a theme the locker room is a theme which gets the psychological attraction of consumers because visually appealing things are always they, they create a lasting impact also we are branding rebranding meditation as a tool to attain happiness and success which also will turn out in our favor i believe we are also getting the latest few things that are not seen by people here they are not aware we are bringing it from the west we are also getting our own cooling theory to keep the place cool and to keep the players cool we are getting the internationally used which are not used here the technology to recover the athlete's body the ice bath technology also further more technologies to add and we are doing this at a at a mid range price to cater all of them all of the market the ease of options also make us interesting as we offer, we choose to offer them daily weekly monthly passes we give them a mass app to manage their bookings we are also trying we will also try to affiliate the other small players in the industry to link with us and market their workouts so that person can pay for workout and enjoy the weight free session at their workout but a true our name this is our go to market strategy the initially the focus will be to raise awareness to brand fitness mental fitness and fitness as a very important value and every human being should focus on that and how it's really important for them to get fit and how getting fit impacts their chemicals impacts their brain and impacts their overall lifestyle this is through content marketing we want to generate interest and then we want to pull them to use our service at a phenomenal price in the initial phases so that they come they try and once they try we try to convert them into permanent customers if everything goes to goes according to our plan we plan to launch our first <coughs> unit which will be a the locker room play unit it won't have training part but it will have play watch eat and recover it won't have the training part because the playing area needs to be a large area and that area can be bought in an economical price at the area where it is for it is popular on the contrary the training facility needs to be placed in a very popular market that is a hub and people come so we could not call, uh, open these two together so we are dividing train into other unit and play into other unit so the first unit that we kick start is the play unit because with this unit we are very sure that we can run this 100% successfully we have been playing 
we know the industry inside out how this functions so the first we are confident with the first unit then our strategy will be focused on increasing awareness and attracting the customers we when we build this and we do our part to attract the customers and we do set up everything uh, uh, perfectly we look for the series a funding we look for the series a funding and then our aim with this funding will be to launch 10 units in 2 years or maybe more depending on the funding and the the team that we can get together but the minimum is 10 unit this is in the november our first unit gets into the break even we are we will be quitting after this period the cost will be covered by the revenue itself and we do not have to look into this this is a prediction and i think this is this is a fair prediction then after that we go on to launch more units and we want to build a brand in the first two years focused on customer attraction and retention we want to have our edge in the fitness recovery and food category in fitness we want to focus primarily on the mind and also on the body but primarily on the mind to get them inside the brains and to get them into our routine and this is the next slide is of both of us who have worked on this idea you can read about this we have we are commerce students we have studied in same school then we got out of our course schools and got into separate colleges <coughs> he has studied bba and i have studied the commerce course that is offered here in india we have been part of our various school teams and then college teams we have playing experience in football and also training experience and these are the small things that we have done Shall I move forward? Okay. So this is our last slide, in which we are asking 10 million INR for the first unit and to get it successfully running in the market, cover cost for 18 months, and to get it past the break-even point. This is in rupees. I can if we divide it by 70, it will convert into dollars. This is in INR. I will I will tell you in a minute. Let me calculate. Yeah, I'm I'm telling you in US dollars. it it's about 150000 us dollars 100 to 150000 and yes so this is to set up our first for first unit okay okay so, so okay. what i what, what i want, want to do, do now, now is go is back, go to, back to your slides, slides. to Which so one? Go, so back, go back to the top. To the top. Okay. I want to make comments, comments on each, each one, of one of them since the, since the beginning. Okay. You can, you can, you can, go, you can back go back to the top. To the top. front page okay okay so, so what i'm what i'm gonna do now, now is to is make, to make comments, comments on, on each, each is like in which, which point, point i consider, I consider that, that a pitch, a pitch must, have must have and how, and how it should, should be So the, so the first, first okay. slide is the, is front, the front page, page which, which, is, which your is your cover, cover let's, say. let's say. So, so here, here in, in your, case, your case, you bring, you bring the, name the name of your, of your product, product let's, say. let's say, and a as small, a small sentence, sentence that, that is, is trying, trying to define, to define what, what you do. 
which, which okay. here in this case is, 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 is redefining redefine sports, sports and fitness. Okay. What, I, what like I like seeing in one's, one's light, 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 light in the first, in the first slide, of slide of the presentation, of the presentation is, is a, picture a picture that, that creates create connection. connection. So, so okay. if you if bring, you bring the, name the name of your company, 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 the name of your product, product and an, an image, image that, okay. that represents, represents what, you, what want you want to bring, to bring to the market, to the market. It, will it will direct, direct connect, connect with, with the investor, investor in an in emotional, emotional way. way. So the okay. importance of, of a, picture a picture at the beginning, at the beginning, beginning is, to is to create a connection, a connection right, away. right away. Try, Try to, to select, select a picture, a picture that, that is emotional, emotional. And, and that, that represents, represents the image the of, your, of your, company your company and what, and what your, your value, value proposition, proposition will, be. will be. Okay. Okay. And then, and then the, first the first sentence, sentence that you that bring, you bring in, in this light is that of, of redefining, redefining sports and, sport and fitness, fitness only. only. You should, you should include, include what, what is, is your value proposition. proposition. What, what is the is value, the value that, that you're bringing to the market? To the market? How are How you going to contribute? contribute? What's, What's the, the difference, difference that you're that gonna, you're gonna make? make in people's, people's lives. lives. Okay. So, so if, you if you bring all together, all together in the front, in the front page, page, it will, it will directly, directly connect, connect with, with the emotional, emotional side, side of, of your, your audience, audience brain. 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 So, so the emotional the side, okay. side of your, your audience, audience brain. brain. Think about, Think about it. it. And remember, and remember that, that the first, okay. first impression, impression is the, is most, the most important, important point, point of, of connection, connection that you're that gonna, you're gonna create, create with your, with your audience. Okay. When you're right. preparing your, your, your pitch, pitch and you're, and you're starting, starting with, a, with picture a picture that represents, that represents what, you're, what bringing, you're bringing, it will, it will create, create that, connection. that connection. It will, it will touch, touch the emotional part, part of their brain, their brain and, and your, your pitch, pitch will be more... more uh, you, uh, get you get more attention, more attention okay. and, you and you get, get their, their feelings, feelings for, for hearing, hearing you, you more, more carefully. carefully. Okay, got it. Correct. Does it make, Does sense? It make sense? Absolutely. Absolutely. We can we can to the next, to the next slide. slide. <coughs> we are going to talk. talk. And you talk, and you here talk about, here your, about vision, your vision, right? right? Yes. In a, In sense, a sense, your your vision, vision you, rep you represent. represent what what your your value proposition. Value proposition is is so, so if, you, if include you include your value, your value proposition, proposition in the first, in the first slide, slide of your presentation, of your presentation. Okay. it will it kind will of, kind of substitute, substitute to one slide, slide that, that, that will, will tell about, about your vision. Okay. I think this slide is, is, is good, but, but if, if you, are you are bringing the value proposition at the, at the beginning, 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 this is this like okay. not, is not mandatory. mandatory. So, if, so you if, have, if you have... Okay, so we can... If you don't, if have, you don't have too much time, time to make a presentation, presentation and, and to pitch your, your startup, startup. Okay. this slide this could be, be condensed, condensed it could, it be, could be reduced, reduced with, with your, your value, value proposition. proposition. Okay. 
But I but like, I like the, way, the way that you organize this light. light. You bring, you bring picture, picture, you bring, you bring small, small sentences, you bring, you bring a highlight, a highlight in, in keywords. keywords. The layout, the layout of this, of light this light is very, is very good. good. What, what I would, I would add, add when you when talk you about, talk about your, vision, your vision, I would I add, would add uh, a, a, time a time frame, frame here. here. Because, because you said, you said you that you your, vision your vision is, is to, be a, to be a pioneer and leader in either sports, in sports fitness, fitness and wellness, wellness industry, industry by providing, by providing superior, superior service and user, and user experience, experience with, with the use, the use of, of modern, modern technology. technology. What I what like, I like to, do to do when I when define, define my vision, my vision is, to is to establish a timeline. A timeline. So, so I want, I want to, reach to reach at that, at that point, point in that in period, that period of, time. of time. It will it make, will make me more, more straight, straight to the point, point to, to follow, follow my goals, my goals. Month, month, month after month, after month year, year after year, year, year until, until I get there. Get there. So, if, so you if you include a time a period, period, period here, here, it will it make, make you have, have a, a Clear, clear goal, goal in a in a right right in a, uh, in a period, in a period of, time of time that you are that seeking, you are seeking to, be to be the, the and to reach, and to your, reach vision. your vision. Okay. This is one this thing, is one that, thing I that I would add, add here, here on, your, on vision. your vision. And another, and another aspect, aspect of, of your vision, your vision, vision that is that the, uh, it's not it's not very very clear, clear how. how not how, not how. What, what you are going to be. Gonna be. Because, because you mentioned you that don't you want to be a pioneer, pioneer either in either sports, sports fitness, fitness and wellness, wellness industry. But it's, but a, it's a huge, huge industry. And you, and also, you also include, include three, three industries in, in one. one. So you so want, you to, want be to be everything. everything. And by and being everything, everything, it's hard, it's hard to, define to define what, what you, will you will be. be. And it, and it possibly, possibly will make you, make you, you be, confused be confused on your, on strategy, your strategy and yeah, your, yeah. Your, on your, on your efforts, efforts going, forward. going forward. Okay, so we should keep this concise and limited in number. How should we, how should we get past this problem of having multiple things under one vision? Mm, I didn't, I didn't hear, you. hear you. So my, my question is, how can we solve this problem? So we, when we initially started with this idea, we wanted to create a playing space just with the uh, artificial turf. And there we wanted to do the play, watch and eat, just the three. Can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you. No. So, so, in the we just had the edit in your main space. During the entire day, or there, from there, who can do that one? Me now? Try again. Try again. Hi, hi. Hello, you can hear us? Very low. Very low. Now? <laughs> now, it's, now it's better. And now? Okay, so initially when we started with this project, we had a simple thing in our mind that was to create a facility, just the playing facility with watch events in the weekends and creating a in-house cafe to meet the demands of young players who come there to play. 
then as we proceeded in our journey to get this project out in the market we came across people who asked me to expand the vision the investors want to know what you have after 2 years of operating you are not not just here to get the money start one unit and then stop you need to go then we started to strategize how we can get this vision it was it was it, it I, company i've heard you at the certain point point and then then it was broken but let but let me see if i understand correct your your concern is, is how to how present, present it, it in a, in a most effective way, way larger to, to, to make the best investors see that you are planning, your long time, time, your long, long, time, long, long vision. vision. Correct, correct. Is, is, to, to, is not, not only, only focused focus on, on one thing, thing. is really disrupted really 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 a, a whole only in the right, right? Yes, to, to make it a big company, to make it, it a, a very large to, to, to make it grow and to make a mark on the world, you cannot just have one unit. You need to expand, you need to use your talent, you need to grow. For that, we needed, we, we were just clear with our first unit. We were just clear with what we want to do in the first, say, 12 months or 18 months. We knew about that, but we were not sure when we <coughs> get past the stage, how will we grow? How will we take, how will our vision proceed? If we hadn't done this, now we had to do this same thing after maybe 16 17 months and then we would be in the middle of some project and we would <coughs> lose time that we could have utilized to grow so this was to make sure that people whoever invests in us in seed funding they get the clear vision of how we want to take this brand further and how and where we want to grow Correct. Okay. 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 Correct. It's not bad that you want to be big. It's not bad that you want to grow. 
it's not it's bad, bad, bad that you know, somebody can, can make an impact, impact in the world. In the world. The, op the opposite is very good. good. However, However, you need, you need to demonstrate, demonstrate focus, focus and, and a very, a very clear, clear vision of where, where, where you, want, you to want to be. And, and this vision, vision should, should be reach reachable. Okay, correct. plug in the charger can you wait for two seconds just just a second
Hello? Hi, hi. Hi, Mr. Tonsa, can you hear us? Yes, yes. Perfect, perfect. Sorry, sorry for the interruption. No problem, no problem. Okay, so we have to focus on the persona. We have to show them how a day in their life will be changed if our solution comes out in the market and how their problems will be solved. The targeted market, the, the segments in the market that we have segmented, basically our target market, how that a day in our target market will be changed if our services are launched in the market. Exactly. Okay, got it, Mr. Tonda. So once you, once you have defined what, what is, just one second here. Okay, so once you have talked about your persona and the problems that this persona is facing right now it will create a connection with the audience which will be the investors why because they will have a clear image on their mind of the problem that you are trying to solve Yes, this is uh, an aspect that, just one second. Okay, so this is one aspect that uh, it's good to focus because I know that you are going to solve uh, a variety of problems of a variety of public. But what I would suggest you to do is to create a story where you could connect the most problems in one single story. And you can talk about different personas in this story. So you talk about John, you talk about Mary, you talk about different personas. Just give me one second. Hello? No? Wait. Ixi, agora não vou poder. Não vou conseguir atender. Estou numa reunião aqui. Falou. Ok, sorry. Did you understand what I mean? So, when you are trying to solve different problems from different personas, but with one business, you can create a story that connects all problems in one story but having different personas behind it so what you're gonna say is John John has this problem and Mary has this problem but Anne has another problem so how they could live today with those with all those problems they face these difficulties they are not healthy they are very stressed and each one of them has problems that our company will solve and then it will bring you to the next slide 
and it's a perfect match with the flow of the presentation for you to present the solution. The way that you're gonna build your presentation, it's key to tell a story in a very effective way. So the next slide, which is the solution that you're gonna bring, will address the problems of all personas that will be included in your story. When you talk about your solution, a very good way to demonstrate what you are gonna propose to your client, what you're gonna offer to your client, is to bring pictures and images of your product. So here you mention topics that you are gonna touch. So you're gonna touch the play problem, the watch problem, the train problem, and the eat problem. But I can't see the product here. What are you gonna, what, what your product will be? In this slide, when you present your solution, it's key for you to present uh, an idea of what you're gonna bring to the market. Is it an arena? Is it a service? Is it a app? Is it a software? Is it what? What is it? The sound, the sound is low again. Now it's better. Great. The train is also in service, the weight free service, and the training, the meditation is also, meditation is an art that we are going to teach, so it's again a service that we are going to use to strengthen the mind and body, and then rejuvenation therapy is also a service. So we, inside the area, we get the skilled trainers and we make sure that they deliver people what they can. Okay. And Yeah, I think you could demonstrate what you're exactly saying by showing pictures. Yes, correct. We can try to to create. Uh, I would say a demo, but I'm not sure how easy it would be. But what I would do is that in a simple way, just say that you are gonna build an arena. It's a space, it's a, it's a, it's similar to a stadium, but in a different way. And in each part of this place, you are going to be able to do different activities. And in this part of the local, 
of the building, you are gonna be able to play. In this part, you are gonna watch, and then you can create a, a story around that. So you you you're gonna say that John will go to the arena in order to play soccer, but then after he had played, now he he might be hungry, but he needs to eat a healthy food, which will be available in the in the lunchroom. And then after that, he would be able to watch or play video game. You know, try to create a story around the problems and around the solution. It will create more connection and it will be easier to understand what you are providing to the market. So, once you have talked about your value proposition, you have created an emotional connection by showing a picture at the first slide and then telling a story of all your personas that will bring you to the solution where you are going to keep, keep going talking about the story and presenting the idea. It's time to say why it's different from other companies that are in the market. Because you are going to talk about the problems and these problems might not be solved by the competitors or by, by not be solved completely by the competitors. But now you have a solution that really differentiates you from the competitors. And then you can bring the compet competition slide right here. And you can say that John, Anne and Mary, they don't have, they don't have their needs met by any solution in the market. But with your solution, they will be, be they will be able to solve all the, the problems that they are facing now and the competitors they are not willing to do that because they are focusing on other strategy or they are focusing on other aspects so they are focused here there and there and we we are different we are focusing on a complete solution that will be able to solve Mary John and Anne's problem And in, in order, and the next slide will be the market size, because when you talk about the problem, the solution, and the differentiation, the next slide will be. But John, Mary, and Anne are alone. No, they are not alone, because today in the world. We have this amount of people with the same problems as John, this amount of people with the same problems as, as Anne, and this amount of people with the same problem as Mary. So, in the total market of India, which is where we are going to start our business, we have X million people that will require a service that we are providing. And in the first year, we, were, we are able to get 1% of this market. Three years from now, we will be able to get 10% of the market. And then we are going to expand to other parts of India and other parts of the world. Once we have a consolidated market, once we have tested our model, and then we will be able to expand. So it will be more... It will be less... Less hard to believe. Because when you, when you present the market size, saying that there is 90 billion 
dollars in opportunities by 2022 it's hard to believe that you are gonna you're gonna have a very impressive market share in this market but if you start saying that your market your target is in India at the first time and then you you have a plan to make it bigger and to expand to other regions after having the experience after having your model consolidated and tested I will believe easier on your idea and on your project. In the slide that you're presenting the market, it's uh, the information that you present are relevant information. However, the way that you present is kind of uh, You understand what I mean? Yeah, what I what I like doing when I when I present market size, I would present with a geometric symbol, like a circle. You can use a small circle, saying that it's your market share right now or in the next year. And then you present the addressable market that is a market that you believe you are going to reach in the middle term. And the total market, which is huge, but you are not get it completely. But it will present the, the idea of how big you are gonna be or you will be able to be Okay, so next slide. Let's move to the next slide because here you still talk about the characteristics of your persona right somehow let's talk about your business model Include it in the in the page. Yeah, I think it's better now. You you are projecting in the in the whole screen. Okay, it's better. So talking about your. Okay, let's talk about your business model now. 
just before talking about your business model, let's go back and take a look on the story that you are telling the investor. You talk about your value proposition in the first slide with an image that touches the emotional part of the brain and then you create a story to talk about the problems of your personas and match them with the solution that you're going to bring into the market and compare the solution with the competitors saying that this market is big and you are going to start with a small amount of participation so we are going to start with a specific market share and then you are going to grow and how are you going to grow your market share you are going to grow your market share by your business model because you are going to charge your products in this specific ways so we are going to focus on four products play train watch and eat each one of them will have different business model the first one will be pay per hour the second one will be a subscription the third one will be pay per entry and then the last one will be commissions and we are gonna sell it or food but you are not saying here how much you're gonna charge if you're gonna charge for everyone equally or if you have different options so in the business model you should present what is the model of revenue that you're gonna have which is presented here but also how much are you gonna charge by each one of them and if there will be different forms of charge of charging people and then you're gonna present your revenue numbers and when you present your revenue or the financial numbers of your presentation you should consider the amount of money you're gonna charge per single unit that you're gonna sell and how much money are you gonna make considering the number of users or clients you're gonna have here you present it in a very good way I like the way that you present it but I'm kind of lost because because it's not very clear for me what is 500 football what is this You know what's what's strange here it's not strange but it's missing is how much are gonna charge per hour okay, 
because if I don't have this information, which should be in the slide before, it's hard for me to do the math. So if you bring this information, it will be a lot easier to know what you're talking about and how you get these numbers from. So the next slide. We already talked about the competition. Yeah, the next one should be before the way that you mentioned, yeah. I wouldn't present this slide in a, in a three minute pitch. I would only mention those information when you are talking about your product versus the competitors one yeah okay next slide <coughs> go to market strategy When you talk about your go-to-market strategy, you need to consider how you are going to reach the market and the clients that you are defined as your target. So, using all those informations, all those aspects, It's not wrong, uh, all those aspects are real possibilities for you to reach your target audience, your prospects. However, as investor, I don't see clearly where you are gonna focus. I don't know if you are gonna invest more in email market or in word of mouth if you are gonna develop a referral program or if you are gonna invest in SEO what I what I need to see here is what is your go-to-market strategy to reach the target that you want to be able to get the revenue that you said yeah try to see try to be more specific in measuring how much money you are going to make if you if you use each one of these strategies if one of these tactics try to try to develop a benchmark there are information in in studies that you can find on the internet that would help you to find those numbers if you are not in if you are not implementing those strategies or those tactics yet you should benchmark to have at least a good perception of the return of each one of them and the costs of each one of them and this is a critical information that's uh, you should present what is or what will be the cost of acquisition of clients 
It's a number that will make your strategy. Uh, I forgot the word. Feasible. If you have a CAC, a cost of acquisition of clients that is higher than the lifetime value that these clients would be able to provide to you in the long term, you don't have a business. If you have this information and provide this information for the investor, it's way easier for them to decide to invest or not. Sorry? Yeah, for example, social media, you are going to invest on Facebook. So, if you invest a hundred dollars and be able to get one client out of this a hundred dollars, if this client would be able to have a lifetime value of $200, it seems to be a business. It seems to be uh, a business that has a potential. And it will also help you in defining the best strategy for you to follow. Because when you compare each one of those tactics, you're gonna have a clear view of what is working or what's not working. And then we'll have the ability to change the go-to-market strategy if necessary, if needed, based on the results of each one of them. So, next slide. Roadmap. I like the roadmap slide, the way that you presented, because you present a timeline, you present the main projects that you're going to focus on, and it's, it, it brings me, it, it, will, it allows me to analyze your business better in your strategy better uh, so the layout is very good what I would add here as comments for you to consider is the information that you're gonna provide here I like to see go to market strategies here in the roadmap why because it will make your numbers your projections make sense for me or not yeah when you are mentioned here for example strategy focused on increasing awareness and customer attraction okay it is good it is good However, what will be the strategy here? Are you going to test all the go-to-market strategies that you mentioned in the slide before? How much money are you going to locate in each one of them? So it's not very clear. What I would do here is to select the main ones that you consider the most effective on your market and start with them. 
So in the first two months, two or three months, we are going to test three tactics of the go to market strategy and let's measure the results. In the next three months, we are going to keep the one that provide us the best result and we are going to test three more. And then it will give me a better view of your strategy and how you're going to implement the strategy. And the next slide. Founding team. Yes, this is a, a critical slide when you present the team. I would say that this is the most important slide of your presentation. Because when you are in the beginning of your business, the most important assets that you have in your company are people. So, it's critical and the way that you mentioned here the team i would consider that you you should include more characteristics not individually but more characteristics of the ideal team that you would have in order to make your business grow and be or become an unicorn so when you are building this business what are the key people that you're gonna need i know that at this time you have two members which is the founders and probably there's nobody else however you should include that you have two founders you have support of advisors and those advisors should be experienced advisors or mentors and key roles that are missing for you to hire or to bring to the company but you believe that are critical for your business or they are critical for the success of your business sorry i didn't hear you My name? Yes, can we use your name as well if we put there in the advisors or mentors? <laughs> Let's talk about it in a moment. Okay, okay, okay. So, this is important. The team should be you, the mentors and advisors, and also the key aspects or the key roles that you are seeking or you are looking for and then to conclude you present the investment needs but you didn't mention the valuation and the percentage that you are gonna yeah for them so if i'm gonna invest in your company and i would invest a hundred fifty thousand dollars what's the percentage of your company that i would have it's missing here so it's really it's directly connected with the valuation uh, but it's important for investors to know
valuation is a complicated theme it's not easy to define we have different ways of defining it but what I would do before defining the valuation is to go back to the strategy review the whole presentation based on the devices that I have gave to you and once you have a clearer view of where you're gonna be what you're gonna do and how you're gonna go to the market you have uh, revenue uh, projections feasible or more feasible and based on those proje projections then it will be the time to take uh, to take time and dedicate time to define the valuation So I believe with all those uh, aspects you would have uh, a very good pitch to present to investors with all information that they would require and at the end what you also need to do is to ask for what you want here in this slide you use funding and contact details in the last slide you should have a call to action you need to have uh, the information about what you want and what you want them to do going forward so after finishing the presentation they will not get their money and transfer to you directly there will be other steps to follow so you need to ask them to take the next step and you need to have a call to action not only the information because the information is missed only the information itself you need to ask directly for a move for an action for them the sound is low again yeah now it's better so I was saying can you give us a few examples on how what do we do in this slide and how do you ask them what to ask them first some, some form of idea sure one very simple th sentence to finish is that would you be able to invest a hundred thousand dollars get fifty percent of your company fifty percent five percent of our company I don't know we need to calculate the valuation and in helping us build the next future of the sports and fitness business in India or in the world okay. you know you know you know how different it is different as in sorry different as in different it is what is different as in how different what i just said is comparing so to are... to the slide that you're presenting Exactly. 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 
Yeah. Exactly. Great. And how did you like the devices, guys? Oh no, the voice was broken again. No, it was very good, but then... Try again. I think it's okay. Great, great to hear that. And many, many entrepreneurs that I talk to, they are seeking for investments and in their presentation, they, they require money to make their projects and ideas and startups. Uh, go out of the paper and have a life but what I see in most of the time is that they need to they need to have uh, an additional help on on their strategy on their go-to-market on the definition of persona and few things that sometimes are missed and it's important to consider for their own business and uh, additional help and additional money would be required but if I would suggest them to choose one I would suggest them to pick advice or to use a mentor to help because it will provide them with the basis that they will need to grow the business if they have the basis they it will be a lot easier to grow the business to get investment to get clients and make it real Sorry. Am I audible now? Uh, if you could talk a little bit louder. Now, now. A little bit louder. Is it okay now? Yes. So we we want to have this information about the industry. So in India, they tell us that now investors do not easily invest on ideas. Yes, it is true. The kind, okay, the kind of project that we have is a capital intensive project in terms of creating the space. It's gonna need that much money to start. It yeah. cannot be done. It can be done, but it won't be at that scale. It will be in a backyard. So when some idea of this kind happens, where we actually need this one hundred fifty thousand dollars. Just get you one minute started. 
the the last sentence or the last two sentence i think it's missing Yes, very, very well now. Okay, I was just trying to mention that if the industry are the investors open to such proposals where the project is shown on the paper in the presentation, but does, does not exist in the uh, physical world, is it, is it that open to invest 160,000K on a project like this? It is it is possible because there are different types of investors out there. I am particular an investor that invest only after MVP and after some traction. I invest on startups that has already have revenue. But uh, there are other investors in the market that are willing to bet or they are willing to take more risks and that they invest on projects before they are on the market on the idea and ideation stage. The call is low again. Can you hear me now? Uh, low still. Now, now? Now, now it's better. Okay, so I was just asking how would you get part of, of, of the group fund because of the It's still it's still low the sound. Is it okay now? Mm, still low. Now? A little better. Okay, so now I'm am I audible? Hi? Hello. Oh better now. Wow, much better. Okay, so people, what the question is, how do you get part of the problem of the group fund because of the risk of our adoption and our traffic? You need to, to find the correct uh, investors. I, I... I don't know who it might be or who possibly might invest in India but probably if you try to connect with the ecosystem the startup ecosystem in India which I know it's growing maybe making connections talking to other entrepreneurs try to find meetups try to find uh, connections in, in, in the market that might open your door doors I think that would be the best way to get the investment in India I know that there are investors in US a lot of investors in US that want to invest in ideas they are in there are a lot of them in Silicon Valley but I'm not sure which type of project they are investing in and 
I'm not sure if this would be the best option for you to reach them directly without knowing them or having a relationship with a close relation or connection with them. I would I would guess that you should start looking for them in England in, in India first try to go into the ecosystem of startup there and uh, ask ask for connections ask for um, for people to introduce you to other people and that's the way I would do it's very low again better great what I, what what I can do for you guys I'm not sure if you are interested but I I work as a mentor if you believe it makes sense for me to present uh, how my mentor mentorship works I would help to I would happy to do that for you do you believe it it would make sense for for me to to serve you as a as a mentor and to explain how the mentorship program that I offer works? So the, I, I just want to put this. Can you hear me? Yeah. So I just want to put this across. We we can fix another time to understand this it's, uh, around one p.m. in the night, and this guy lives far from my. Sure. So I we would love to definitely talk to you because you seem to add value to people and you add value to our project as well. So definitely love to understand how your program works. But I think it is not the right time to talk right now because I need to drop this guy back home. Sure. Sure, sure. So I'm happy to have helped you so far. I'm glad to hear your words. Happy to hear that I could help. Great, great, so we can talk later then. We, we are connected on LinkedIn, I will contact you once again and we can fix another time to talk everything else. Okay, okay guys, thank you, have a thank good you, night. Man. Thank you Mr. Thank you so much, thank you so much. Bye bye.